Hey guys, so I just got back from shopping with my grandma. I go grocery shopping for her now. That way she doesn't have to do it. And then after we were done grocery shopping at No Frills, I ended up getting myself a tripod, which is where my camera is sitting on right now. I got this little tripod. It was about $40 from Best Buy. I really like it because it's very light and I can use it with my phone and my camera. So I'm really happy with that. Um, I was looking at a couple tripods online and I couldn't find the right one. And then when I found this one that I'm using, I thought, well, that looks perfect. It's not too big, not too small. Because every time I went to Best Buy, all the tripods are, like, huge. And it's like, I don't want a huge one. I want something that's kind of, like, you know, like, in the middle. Like, not too big, not too small. So... I decided to get the one I'm using and I love it guys my hair oh my god I need a haircut so bad my hair has been weird for the past couple months like the top part is dark brown and then the light light um, bleh, I can't talk the top part is a dark brown and then the bottom part is like a light brown color like, the last time I dyed my hair was, like, ooh, that'd have to be, like, a year ago now. Um, I don't dye my hair that often, but the last time I did it, it was a year ago. It was, like, last February. And I dyed it purple. The only two colors that I've ever dyed my hair were red when I was 12. Streaked it red, and then also purple, and then blue. Oops, wait, I'll show you guys what my hair looked like. So, the first picture, sorry if I'm looking down, I'm trying to find it, here it is. This is what I looked like when I dyed my hair purple and blue. It was purple with blue streaks. So that's what my hair looked like, like, oh, that had to be like four years ago. And then a year ago, let's see if I can find that picture I was, yeah, it was a year ago. And I dyed my hair purple because I wanted a changing color. Sorry if I'm looking at I'm trying to find that picture on my Facebook. Okay, where is it? Come on. Where is it? Oh, here it is. So this was a year ago. That was exactly a year ago I dyed my hair purple. Oh, it's gonna is it gonna focus today? Yeah, it's gonna focus. That's what my hair looked like. It was purple. That was a year ago. And then let's see if I can find any pictures of me with red hair. I have one picture of my of myself with red hair, but that was like, ooh, like I said, that was that had to be like eleven years ago, maybe twelve, maybe? I don't remember, but it was a long time ago, let's just say that, that I dyed my hair red. And I did it oh yeah, I did my hair red. For when I graduated grade six. That's right. That's why I dyed my hair. Okay. Just came back to me. I was like, why did I dye my hair red back then? Oh, yeah. Now I remember. I was graduating grade six. Okay. Where is that picture of me with red hair? Sorry if I'm looking down, guys. I'm just trying to find this picture. Here it is. That's when I was 12 and I dyed my hair for the first time and it was red. I was so young, guys. It's like so fetus. I really like that dress I was wearing. Most people thought I looked like a jungle. It's like, I guess you could say it's a bit of a jungle dress, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, that was the last time I dyed my hair. Now my hair just looks light brown and all sorts of color brown. So I'll show you guys the outfit I'm wearing today. So I'm wearing my purple shirt. This has become one of my favorites, and then I'm wearing my Beauty and the Beast leggings for my favorite store, Hot Topic. I actually did a haul of Hot Topic. If you guys haven't seen that video, I'll try and link it down below for you guys to go and check it out. Hot Topic has literally become my new favorite store. I love it. I got quite a bit of things from Hot Topic. Um... I'll show you guys my blanket. One sec. 
I have to make it look nice. I don't, I'm not a person who makes their bed, but some days I do, some days I don't. But anyway, here's my comforter. Got it from Hot Topic. I literally saw this on a post on Facebook, like a thing like two years ago, whatever. And when I saw this, I was like, I want this. And then not even thinking about it, my aunt picked it out for me for Christmas. And I got it for Christmas. It's my new favorite comforter. Don't worry, I wash it. I have some family members ask me, do you wash your blankets? Like, yeah. And if you turn it over, it's black with red roses. And then my pillowcases, um, the one side says beauty with the, with the rose, and the other side says beast, so, yeah. Then I also have this cute little One Direction pillow that I got at the Sally Ann. And then all my stuffed animals and all that. So, yeah. I was going to go for a walk today, but this morning it snowed a little bit. Yesterday when I was taking out the garbage, I was like, it's not snowing, is it? Yeah, it was snowing a little bit. It was sprinkling a little bit, so. And then today, I woke up nice up, and I thought, ooh, we'll go for a walk. No, it was too cold for that. So maybe I'll go for a walk later on if it warms up, maybe. I don't know. But um, I'm going to clean my room. My room is an absolute mess. Um, so I'm gonna go clean my room and I will talk to you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so it's later on. I'm just about to watch some Disney, watch, wash, wash, did I say wash? I meant watch. Anyway, I am just about to watch some Disney Plus for the night. I haven't decided what I'm gonna watch. Usually I would normally watch my all time favorite Disney movie, which is Beauty and the Beast. But I'm leaning towards more my second favorite Disney movie, which is The Little Mermaid to watch tonight. But I don't know. There's so many good things to watch on Disney+. Plus. My top three favorite Disney movies are Beauty and the Beast, Little Mermaid, and Mulan. What are your guys' top three favorite Disney movies? Let me know in the comments down below what your top three favorite Disney movies are. So anyway, I'm just trying to pick what movie to watch. Sorry if I'm like looking away, I'm trying to look. As you guys can see, I'll show you. As you guys can see, I think we'll actually focus. Come on. As you guys can see, I was watching Beauty and the Beast. Speaking of Beauty and the Beast, I was watching it. I was watching the animated version. And yes, that is Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. The reason Mickey Mouse Clubhouse is on my continued watching for Disney Plus is because I have a one year old little cousin and she loves Mickey Mouse. At least I think she does. Because every time I play an episode of Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, she like just stares at my just stares at my phone like, what is that? And and she 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 just starts dancing like she I I think she loves it. I'm gonna make them a Disney fan <laughs> while they're young. So that's my problem. I don't know what movie to watch. So yeah, I'm thinking I'll probably watch Beauty and the Beast knowing me. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, there's also Aladdin on here too. Oh, I love the live action of Aladdin. That was really good. But I also like the animated version of Aladdin too, because you know Robin Williams, like childhood. Anyway, I'm gonna try and decide what Disney movie I'm gonna watch tonight, and I will I will let you guys know in a bit as to what I chose. Hey 
guys, so as you guys saw in the last clip, I chose to watch Aladdin, the live action. It was either that or Maleficent, and I chose Aladdin. I haven't watched Aladdin in what feels like forever. I forgot to put that on my favorite Disney movie list. It's um, Beauty and the Beast, Little Mermaid, Mulan, and then live action Aladdin. But yeah, but my top three are Beauty and the Beast, Little Mermaid, and Mulan. So I'm just sitting here watching some Aladdin. I was thinking of going for a walk, but I don't know if it's still cold with the wind. It was chilly with the wind earlier when I was out shopping with my grandma, but I don't know. I was going to text her like, hey, do you feel like going for a little walk? But I don't know if it's still cold out or not. I don't know. I have no idea. Any, Anyway... I'm going to see if she wants to go for a walk, and if I go for a walk, then, then I'll try and vlog it if I can. If not, then I'm just going to watch some Aladdin and relax for the night. But anyway, I'm going to see if she wants to go for a walk or not, and then I will catch up with you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so it's much, 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 much later, and I just finished watching the live action Aladdin. It was amazing. Truly amazing. I highly recommend watching it if you haven't watched it already. It is such a good movie. So now I'm just going to probably watch some YouTube videos and probably head to bed in a bit. What time is it? It's only 9.44. Hmm. Maybe I might watch another Disney movie. Hmm. I think I might watch The Little Mermaid. I haven't watched that in like forever. Fun fact about me. Um, I've been to Disney World twice in my life. The first time I went, I was 10. And the second time I went, I was 15 going on 16. It was the best. I went to Disney World in Orlando, Florida. I remember it was Christmas 2006 and my dad's mom surprised us, surprised me and my younger cousins with a trip to Disney World and we had absolutely no idea. Like, wow. If you guys um, want me to share a couple of stories of my time wait sorry of my, of you guys sorry let me rephrase that if you guys um want me to do a video and share some stories of my two trips from disney world then let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like to hear that anyway my hair is oh my god my hair is such a mess it looks like a lion's mane or maybe a rat's nest. I don't know. My hair it just looks wild. Oh, I was talking to my aunt the other day and we were like l laughing because she's like, oh, when you get to go see your hairdresser when this whole um, coronavirus settles down, just imagine how much hair is going to be on the floor. And I was like, oh my, my poor hairdresser. My hair looks like such a mess oh my god i was joking around with my aunt i'm like i will literally pay anyone 20 dollars to cut my hair my hair looks like trash right now and the only way i can like sort of tan my hair is by putting it up in a ponytail or like just like a messy bun but like even that is just like like oh my God, I need a haircut so bad. I need a haircut so bad. I've seen videos online of like boyfriends and girlfriends like cutting each other's hair. I don't know if I'd be that brave though. Like I've cut my fiance's hair before, but like he usually wants his hair his his hair bald. So like 
can't really screw up if you're gonna shave someone's head bald, right? But like, other than that, like, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I, I'm debating on like just cutting my dead ends. But like, and then a part of me is like, don't cut your hair. You're not a hairdresser. You're not a you're not a professional. I remember this one time I was in grade 11. I was taking cosmetology. And my uncle comes up to me. He's like, so can you cut my hair? I heard you're in cosmetology. Then me not even thinking. I was like, sure, I would love to cut your hair. Meanwhile, little me in the back of my head was like, uh, you never paid attention in class, so have fun. Let's just say my uncle ended up with two bald spots later and we ended up shaving his whole head bald. It was a disaster. I ended up taking pictures and ended up showing my cosmetology teacher. He was like laughing at me because he's like, oh my god, you should like never cut hair ever again. I was like, yeah, this is why I never paid attention to class. Maybe I should have. Anyway, so that's my little story time, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go and watch some YouTube videos and relax for the night. Oh, I, can't, I still can't get over how awful my hair looks. My fiance's like, oh, you look beautiful. It's like, boy, thank you for the compliment, but like my hair looks like absolute trash right now. Oh my God, I need a haircut so bad. I'm just counting down the days to when quarantine will be over and then I can go see my hairdresser again. Cause, oh my, I need a haircut. Anyway, I'm gonna go watch some YouTube videos and probably head to bed after that, but I'm gonna go ahead and end today's vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and comment below on what your top three Disney movies are. If you could choose any three Disney movies to be your top three, what movies would they be? Let me know in the comments down below. I'll have my Instagram as well as my, well, actually, sorry, let me rephrase that. I'll have both my Instagrams, my One Direction fan account, as well as my personal and my Twitter and my iPad. So go and follow me on all my social media. Those will all be linked down below. I hope you guys stay safe, and I hope you guys have a good evening, day, noon, or night, or whatever you're watching this video, and I will catch you guys in, in the next vlog. Bye, guys.